We're live, we're live, we're live. Florida Boxing Hall of Fame Museum here and uh, in, in Fort Myers, Florida. You see it, we're coming in here. We have some new inductees here. We got some stars in there. Antonio Tarver's in there, world champion, lightweight, light heavyweight world champion. We got uh, Nate, Nate Campbell, undisputed champion, but I want to talk about Antonio Tarver Jr.'s fight coming up on Saturday, January 21st. Doors open at 6.30 right here in Tampa. So we're all pulling for Tampa. We're going Facebook Live right here. There's Roberto Duran and my boy Mark. And Roberto Duran's daughter, Dylon. And we got uh, everybody's here. We're here at the Florida Boxing Hall of Fame. And uh, we're having a great day. So we had some lunch. What's up, Mark? It's good to see you. We had some lunch today. Got the champs in here. We're working out. Um, as you can see, got food. We got Ozzy Ocasio, Cruiserweight World Champion. It's up, Ozzy O. All right, all right. It's your weekend. It's your weekend. Coming up. You ready? Ready? I'm ready. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, yeah. Great stuff. Great stuff. So we're here at the Florida Box and all things. Oh, yeah. Where, where, where's the lights in here? Yeah. So, so explain this right here. This is a Cuban team. Okay. What year did they come over here in Florida? Oh, I'm not sure. I know. And there's the guy that sure. brought it here. Well, he's here today. Yeah. 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 Yeah, great champion. Jose, that was um, uh, Casimir won the championship. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, that's right. Hey, man, man, look, man. It's good stuff, man. I appreciate it. I want to show you around. I want to show you around. We're at the Florida Boxing Hall of Fame. I'm going to go through here real quick. You can see the class of 21, 2022. And we're all here at the Florida Boxing Hall of Fame. It's induction weekend. See my man? Yeah. Yeah, that's a museum. And I get all the belts. Yeah, you do it, man. Great to see you guys, man. Remember Lamar Murphy? Yeah. This is a great day. Uh, you know, I love Steve Canton, and I love all the stuff that he's doing here. So it's an induction day. So everybody who's getting an award or getting inducted, they're here today at the Florida Box and all thing. It's great to see you, man. What's going on, bro? Great to see you. I gotta go over to where the stars are. You know me, Steve Cannon and his wife. Here we go, Rocky. Legends, the legend is here. Hello, hello. That's the Tarver take, man. Tarver's in the house. And you got Tarver Jr. working out. Kids are working out. He just getting a sweat in, champ. Just a little sweat. Yeah. Warming up. Are you going to spar today? No. Nate Campbell, lightweight world champion. What's going on, man? It's a great day. I love that floor. I like it. <laughs> As you see, Team Tarver's training. His sons and I have talked to him. Nate Campbell, uh, lightweight, uh, WBO. I think. Oh, is he ready? Ready. 
Hey, hey, what's my hashtag? Tarver Tanko. Uh, the great uh, story never told. That is true. And then you got the book, too. Got you. You've been here the whole ride. But the greatest story never told, bro. And now we're telling it. No, it's just another chapter. Oh, I got you. It's just another chapter. I got you, The book ain't finished, but it's a continuation, though. Yeah. So what's he, uh, when does if he they, fight? If they think I did anything in the game, wait till they get a load of this. Wait till they get a load of this. I got you, champ. Yeah. How do you think? What do you think? Just like I thought. Yeah. Just like I thought. I think just like I thought. That's what I see. Just give him a chance. That's what I see. No, yeah. an opportunity. There you go. Everybody giving us a chance to win. This shit. Yeah, I got it. All we want is an opportunity. You think you can beat us? Fight! Let's go. Now stop the bullshit. <laughs> yeah. I got you. You think you can beat us? Put your name on the line. We there gotta we go. show up. Cause we want all the smoke. I know you hear a lot of people saying that shit, but they don't mean it. Yeah. I mean it. <laughs> I got you, Tim. I mean it. I got you, Tim. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> Tell them the truth. You so got it. God, that's all it is, the truth. That's it. And they know that. They know if they come from here, it's the truth, no it's, matter what. I'm going. Keep it, keep it, keep, keep them going, keep them going. But they think I'm lying, though. They don't want to believe me. They think I'm lying. Everything I say. You just keep going, champ. You that's just keep proving them wrong. You've been proving them wrong. I remember. Look, hey, Aaron Snowman, he know what he's saying. <laughs> he know when he see it. You feel yeah, me? Yeah, what do you think, Snow? It's a difference from seeing it, but he know when he see it. He know when he see it. From the time I seen this song, like, 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 In dynamite shape. Punches, punches are coming off sharper and better. They're more precise and more direct. And he has his old school trainer too uh, with him. They've been around the game a long time. He has progress, second to none. He progress. And I'm telling you, I'm putting him on notice right now. You're looking at the next face in boxing, man. It's the greatest story he ever told at Tokyo Tarver Jr. And I ain't, he ain't following my footsteps, but he finna create his own. There you go. He gonna create his own footsteps. That's what I like to hear, champ. Beautiful speed, boy. Beautiful speed. Keep it going. And you see it, man. We're here. This is it. This is it. It's where the champions are made, right here in the gym. Antonio Tarver, he's the world champion. His son's looking good. We got Snowwell out here. Everybody's fired up on the kid. Here we got her. There we go. There we go. Everybody having a great time. And we give you were having a great time. And uh, Tarver. So what do you what do you see him in his next? The biggest fight. And when a guy has talent, when he can get in there in great shape, his talent comes out. Then I think he's going to be there all night. No, no question. He, he's 
there. He's ready. Sure. Uh, he got a heck of a team. Uh, yeah, he's got just a great team. You you like like no, because no, because see, they, they got Tarver going in next. So everything. You know who Tarver is. And he has it. I see it too. I see it too. Tarver. Yeah, the greatest story never told. Never <laughs> told. I love Tarver, man. I love it. I'm a fan, you know. Here we are, man. We're at the Florida Box and all that. We get some workout. We get some. All right, Junior. You ready? I'm ready. I'm always ready. <laughs> yes, and a future WBC world champion. You got it, man. Yeah. Most exciting. Yeah, it was. You know it. You know it, man. Let's go. I love it. I love it. Good stuff. Good stuff. Yes, it is. Yeah, yeah. He started to come out really good. Yeah, got a great crowd. We got a little workouts going on. We had food, um, the gym. We got Stephen Ken, and then we got the inductions coming up. It's gonna be exciting. Indiana, 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 Indiana,
I'm so glad you made it. I'm so glad you got it. All right, go get Tarver. Go get him, Junior. I see a man. Now, now we're, looks like we're going live. We got Tarver in his house. And, We got Junior here and uh, we're going to talk. We're going to hit some mitts. Hit the mitts here for a little bit. He's got his team here. He's got his conditioning guy. He's got his trainer. He's going all out. And, you know, Tarver, he's got a kid to the WWE. Just twerk out for a few minutes and the scene at these mitts. Well, you know, it's uh, exciting. Uh, and this is how you get the people and they bring it to the fans. Antonio Tarver, uh, Jr., the kid on the grind, uh, looking sharp, getting some moves. He's got some, he's got some sharp moves, looking sharp. Started at the age of 22, he, got his, he started kind of kind of late. But, you know, you got to give it to the kid up on the on the, where he's come and from, you know, the way he turns. His punch is over. And uh, so he's going to be able to see how he adjusts on the fly to Stepford Styles. Yeah. You can see he's being trained by his dad, who, who knows exactly what he's doing. He's been to the top. So this has been a blessed day. And again, Florida Box and all thing. I'll probably go live one more time today. And I'm probably going to post more pictures today because it's a special day. So uh, this is a museum. And we talk about it. See what we can do. To your opinion, why do you look? 
that you've trained in the past, Aaron Snowball. The surgeon, the surgeon. Who upset, who upset Chavez? Talk about how you got to Indianapolis, Indiana to fight your boy fighting uh, uh, Roy Jones Jr. Well, number one, I got to Indianapolis and they and they the Hall of Fame by Craig Hall, recognizing stardom and people with talent. Uh, number one, I want to thank you, Craig. Thank you. A big fight between Roy Jones and uh, Richard Hall. On HBO. On HBO, Richard Hall and one of the Yeah, uh, 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 the Pacers. Yeah, yeah, great, yeah. 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 Vernon, Vernon Forrest and Shane Mosley. Wow. Fight that one. I think Vernon had his number. Matthew Saad Muhammad. That's the fight of the century. Yeah, what a great fire. Yeah, great fire. <laughs> Those guys mixed it up. Yeah, I, I just posted. I just posted on uh, Eddie, Eddie Mustafa Muhammad, who was the WBA heavy, light heavyweight world champion in 1980, and he beat the great Marvin Johnson from Indiana. But they had that picture of Marvin Johnson, Yaki Lopez, uh, Matthew Saad Muhammad, and Eddie Gregory. I mean, can you get any better than that, you guys? WBC back. Yeah. Very far. Yeah, we go, go, let's go. The Tarver Tank. 
They looking good, man. They looking good. You see them all here. We're training. We're working out. Hey, 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 champ. I'm going I'm to hand you the belt already. <laughs> <laughs> The WBC baby, the WBC baby, he's coming for, he's coming for the belt. <laughs> the WBC, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Back over in Tarver, the great work. He came here and put an exhibition on today. They didn't have to, and the Magic Man brought him. He looked sharp, and he, yeah, getting their pictures. And here we go, man. It's been picture day. It's been a blessed day. Everybody's been getting their work in. And reaching out to fans. And, uh, yeah, reaching out to people. Tell them you care. Yeah. Here we go. Great pictures, get some great stuff. <laughs> you got it, you got it. It's been a great day. Let's see it, man. One thing about Antonio Tarver, he came to the Indiana Box and all the thing. And uh, he took pictures with everybody. He saw an autograph for free. He did everything he possibly could to uh, inspire people. There it is. He's just signing autographs right there. You didn't have to. And uh, not charging his dime. And uh, he's uh, here supporting people. And what a great day. Been a blessing. You know, you know, he's, he's, got a son. he's got a son following his footsteps. And it uh, looks looking pretty good. good you, looking pretty good. I think I'm going to go over and steal a cookie from you. So. Back over to Tarver. Uh, Ned, I got a question for you, though, okay? The greatest... USA boxing team of all time, in your humble opinion. 84. 84? I know that I always have some guys. Hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. Jack, wait, wait, I'm going to explain to you why. 84, everybody loves but one person. 76 was a great team, a bunch of great fighters. Look at the, the sheer amount of, sheer amount of, what's the word? Awesome, awesome. Experience. Not experience, the sheer amount of, of the, the destruction you had. Then you had, you had Parnell, you had Xander, you had Mark Breeder, Melvin Taylor, you had um, Henry Tillman. Henry Tillman. All right, yeah. Everybody knows. Yeah. All right, all right. And I also asked you to have a running joke at you guys. Thanks, Marcus. What would you like to be the one guy on that book back to home up? And you know And you know what? The two best, well, from the 84 team, Holyfield got disqualified for hitting the guy late at the end. Yeah, right on the bell. Yeah, right at the bell. And then Tyson was an alternate, and he ended up taking over when he got right. when he got older. But think about this. Think about this. The greatest, who is the greatest amateur boxer of all time? What is it? Who is Mark Green? Mark Green. What is the record? 110 and 1. 110 total. They don't count smoke. They only count international. So he was undefeated as an international competition. He only lost one time. Great fight. Dude, there was nobody good as Mark. Mark was There's one guy on that did more than Mark. Who? Look, here we go. He won every tournament in one year. But he didn't win. What about Stevenson? I know. When you talk about the sheer amount of sheer record, there will never be another one. 
What about 70? What about, what about? What Greatest team of ever, every time. <coughs> Here we go. You heard it. I think 84 is better, more sound overall boxing, skill for skill. What year did you win the title? I won my title. What's that? 2008. 2008. At what? At what weight? And who? And, and for what belt? I'm a I'm a Diaz fan too. <laughs> I know. I'm still a fan. Yeah. But Campbell, I appreciate you, man. WBA, WBC, IBF, and WBO world champion. Oh, okay. Okay, and I like that though. Thank you, man. There you go. How are we doing? I'm going to get a little bit of sparring over here. I'm going to cut it off today. You get a little bit of sparring. You see a little bit of fighting. You get to check out the museum. You got the fighters. And it's induction day today. So the next thing they're going to do is after this workout, we're going to put the top uh, dogs in there. We're going to get some pictures of the inductees. And it should be great. Right there. Man, you got you got to go to my YouTube, champ. I told you about. Yeah, yeah. Indiana. Okay. Indiana Boxing Hall of Fame. YouTube. Indiana Boxing. Boxing. Yep. Hit that. Okay, go to subscribe. It's, it's yep. And the first one's Jake Paul, Don King. Next one is Mike Tyson. Next one is Mike Hercules Weaver, WBA heavyweight world champion. And there's Antonio Tarver, who's up here speaking. Yeah, also, they're yeah, in they, yeah, they're in mine. He fought in Indiana, man. Don King got in mine. He put on shows. But I'm talking, what's up? I'm on Instagram and Facebook, Indiana Boxing Hall of Fame. Yeah. yeah. Pleasure to meet you. Thanks. Thanks. There you go. That's how it's called networking. Go around. I got to get these guys. I got to rise these guys. I want to hear about. I want to hear about this promotion. This what is it, TK or something or TK? Is it what is kind of promotion is it? What kind? What kind of promotion is it? T and K. So you're T and she's K. I got it. So that's how you named it. T. So you're everywhere. We have a show next week. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Metro Florida Junior Dunia for the Vice President. And I'm going to be supporting you for this day and at the end of my seventh day. May 19th and 20th. You guys gotta be there. Yeah. Craig, don't you have the the Horda, yes, I'm going to do that one. We ready? <laughs> We're going to get it going. It's going to be a great year. You do a lot of great work, man. I appreciate you. Seriously, yeah. Yeah, you do. You do a great job. And then you got you, got, you got the T and you got the K. I got it. I, I didn't know where it was up. I was like, what? What's TC? What's no? It's TK. I got it now. Thank you. I've got some bar tricks. I got. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's it's magic. It is magic. It is magic. I don't want to show it all. You know what I'm saying? But you know, you got to get you got to get them looking this way and going that way and stick them and move them and all that. Hey, thank you guys, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate Yes. Could you hold this one second? Absolutely. <laughs> Thank you. There we go. There we go. We're here at the uh, Florida Boxing Hall of Fame this year, and we're having some great stuff. And I'm gonna get ready to get off here, and then we're gonna go live one more time before we get out here. But you see it, man. This place is packed. Tarver supporting. Port Antonio Tarver, Nate Diaz. Uh, I got my other man, world champion here as well. It's a great day, some great stuff. You see some great people, and uh, I'm gonna get these guys, get them going. Been a great, some great stuff. We're going out the door, as you see. Florida Boxing Hall of Fame: Ray Mercer, Alexis Arguello, Hector Camacho. You don't stop out here, man. They don't stop. You guys have a blessed one. All right, look, he is still over here working. Throw the jab, champ. Throw the jab. There you go. All right, who's got YouTube on their phone? <laughs> All right, guys. All right, man. Uh, you guys have a blessing.